The 10-Minute Bedtime Routine How to streamline Sleepy Time Club's bedtime routine to just 10 minutes. There will be nights when 20 minutes for tuck-in time is a stretch, but Sleepy Time Club has that covered. Each bedtime kit comes with the same sequence of stories, songs, and cue phrases that help children transition to sleep. There may be nights when you're too tired to do all 20 minutes. Plus, you're not finding your child's questions and observations all that delightful. And you feel guilty that you just want to walk out of the bedroom and have some grown-up time. Here's how to streamline. Keep the cues. The cue sentence before the snuggle up and cuddle song is one of the signposts along the road to sleep. Then sing or even read the song. It has so many messages that set up bedtime as a special time. It affirms the rhythm of daytime and sleepy time and that each child is a child of light. And that caregivers participate in this loving bedtime ritual. These poems including ones by classic writers like Christina Rossetti and Robert Louis Stevenson. Fill your child's head with new vocabulary. Exposure to the natural world. And because they're interactive, continue the caregiver relationship in special ways. This is so much more than this little piggy. Gentle touch at bedtime will calm down a child, giving them the sense of security they need to sleep soundly. Besides, I always thought this little piggy could get a little raucous. These short poems introduce four to six new ASL words into kids' vocabulary each month. Children love being empowered with new skills. And because everyone has a bedtime, they're practiced daily for a month before new ones are introduced. The words are also in the context of a poem or mini-story. Kids love learning things through stories. Each bedtime kit introduces a new lullaby. Sing it together, knowing that you're part of a chain of connections that goes back generation. Because songs and stories are family heirlooms that can never be taken away. Isn't that the best gift to your family? Ever? Don't skip this practice. You'll want to allow some time to really listen and experience with your child their days. Let them release their gratitude and even their frustrations on a ship of clouds. Or float away in a stream, or have a heron fly them to the moon for safekeeping. So let's add this up. Cuddle up song, one and a half minutes. Interactive poem, about 30 seconds. Sign language, about 30 seconds. Lullaby, about one and a half minutes. Plus, put the day to bed, less than five minutes, equals nine minutes. And I get it, those nine minutes might stretch to 12 or 15 minutes because you're having so much fun with your child. Or the inevitable questions. But that doesn't matter, because what I remember about Tuck and Time was when you picked up a book, started reading, and thought, Oh, crikey, how long is this book? And I'd look at the clock, see my evening draining away, start to race through the words. And of course the kids could tell. So even if I'm lingering over a story or song in a Sleepy Time Club bedtime kit, even if I'm including the story from Moon, which is six and a half minutes long, I can see the finish line. Which brings me peace and calm as well as my child. For a super streamlined routine, use the first cue phrase followed by the cuddle up song. The cue phrase before put the day to bed and put the day to bed. And linger a bit together in gratitude. No matter what, Sleepy Time Club really is bedtime made simple. Have a peaceful tuck-in time and dream on.